Hi, my name is Richard. I'm a volunteer with Max Courage, and today I'll be reading an essay on courage written by Kimora Miles, taught by Francisca McDougall from Belmopan, Belize. Courage. What is courage to me? Well, we all know that there is a time when we all need courage. Courage gives us a platform to build on, and the greatest part, a voice. Without it, we would not be able to stand up for what we know is right. Courage is the path that keeps us going when we are facing tough times. I needed courage when my mom passed away with leukemia. My little sister and I thought that we would be living on the streets. We started crying, and I had to find a way to calm her down. A few days later, we found out that our before our mom had passed away, she had already planned where my sister and I were going to stay until we were old enough to go live on our own. Before she died, she asked her boss to take care of me, and my sister was to go live with her dad. While I was living with my mom's boss, she had three sons. I was the only girl, and most of the time, I thought that they were always picking on me. When I heard that she was a police officer, I became afraid, because police officers like to beat on innocent people, or so I thought. Throughout the time I was living there, a voice was always telling me to have courage and tell her how I really felt. Every time that voice came into my head, I always blocked it out. Then that one night, the two of us were eating alone. I decided to talk to her about how I felt. One voice in my head would say, don't, she will beat you. The other one would say, do it because the problem will only get bigger. So I decided to tell her how I felt. I was relieved from that night on. I was no longer holding back what I had to say to her. I had found my voice. There are many people out there who find it hard to attach to something or someone new. Always listen to that positive voice in your head or else the problem will only get bigger and you won't be able to find a solution to it. A wise person once told me to speak out and be bold because life is not going to get any easier and no one will help you if you don't speak out. No one can help you without knowing what you are feeling inside. That was how I got my courage to make a stand for what I know was right.